at the plate. There are two away. Oh, my. Way back. He got it. Goodbye. Home run. Let's put up another first. Watch this celebration. Daniel Alio for Uganda, their first ever <laughs> World Series homer. Boy, he got the head. He got the head to it, and he knew it. And it looked like everybody on the Ugandan team was more excited than he was. I think he was almost embarrassed or, or shy. Yeah, he's up to that right now. I know your mom is quite the cheerleader. Uh, do you embarrass the kids with your with your cheering? Oh my goodness! <laughs> light tower power over the light tower. <laughs> She's speechless, you guys. <laughs> Adachi backed up on it and he was safe, but oh, he hits one way up there. Has he tied the game? He has. That's a big fly. One to one. You could kind of see that coming. Yeah, second time through. Wow. I don't blame him. I, you know what? Yeah, you know, you hear some announcers, people describe it as light tower power. We got to come up with something else. That went over the light standard there in left center field. I think it was. It was it higher. Was over the Single, double, home run, two RBIs. I think he hits it too hard to hit a triple. Pull one down the line. Oh, oh, another one. That's a grand slam for Cole Wagner. Way up on the hill. 18 to nothing, Pennsylvania. I want to go down there and shake his hand. Six RBI, two home runs, and the show continues. Look at this. I didn't think you could hit one foul on the picture. first one. Look at the picture. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> that is beautiful. <laughs> well, how about that one? Up onto the hill. Goodbye. Yeah, so that counts as impressive. He's got a double. He's got a triple. And now he's got his first home run in Williamsport. Well, if you saw his first two at bats, they were on the line. Both balls were hit hard enough to get out. Just didn't didn't have any air. This had plenty. How about that? I think he knew he got it right about there. You hit one that far. I think you're allowed to watch it for a while. We're on the hill this time. Two oh. home runs for South Korea in the inning. Three in the game. Don't hurt him. <laughs> Jeff White, Brian L Elwine. Uh, they said. It, he can hit it in the trees. Now, if he hits it that far, I it just it, that'd be amazing. Huh. There you go. It's a grand slam, no doubt. And guess what? It's in the trees. You know, we rehearsed this before the game, folks. Uh, not really. Um. That one went so far, I am choked up. Uh, <laughs> that ball uh, just, uh, I don't know, it was probably 375 feet. Uh, no doubter. This ball way up top of the berm. A big grand slam. And, you know, you feel bad for, you know, the South Carolina team. Henry Carter out there, his teammates out there consoling him. Uh, but this is, a, you know, this is just a big, big, strong kid. Jace Blaylock and... Shelton. Uh -oh. Uh oh, massive shot. Deep left field. Onto the hill. He's done it again. Does 
to play, big man. There we go. That was majestic. Yeah, it was. That was up there for a while. Maybe just shy of 300 feet. About 280. We may have a new clubhouse leader for distance after that one. He passed himself on the list. Exactly. Combined distance. They wanted it up out of the zone, missed it in his zone. And oh. <laughs> that is a thing of beauty. He has robbed of a hit his first time up in a fine play at third. He puts this one even further. Way back. And goodbye home run out on the road. He hit it beyond the fence, the folks, and the field. And it hits the road and bounces into the parking lot across the street. Three hundred feet. Are you kidding me? That's the other way, too. The breaking ball out of way. All the way up in the box, try to get it before it breaks. Watch where this lands. One fence, two fence. On the road. That's the security gate where we come to work through. That's shot right over the toe outs. Kai Cummings. Oh, that is not coming back. You just turn around and just look at it. Oh, that's a pretty baseball. Pennsylvania's first home run since the first inning of their. They're figuring out Johnny Rosario with a couple of seeing eye singles back up the middle. That's not a single, that's a home run. Samuel Juarez wow. halfway up the hill, almost three quarters of the way up. Mexico's got a four nothing lead. Probably a 285-foot blast. This is the furthest one that I've seen hit here. I mean, it's different at Volunteer. You can't really tell exactly how far they go all the time. But this one, this one is a no-doubter. Back-to-back singles up the middle and one swing right there. Samuel Juarez makes it 4 nothing on a monster home run. You know, we all hear the different sound a baseball can make off a wooden bat. When it's hit well off of aluminum, it makes a different yeah, sound, too. It is unmistakable. Lit it up in the Southwest Regional offensively as well. Oh, my goodness. Don't even move. Halfway up the hill, almost to the top of the first hill. Hunter Ditsworth, two-run shot. Makes it 3 nothing, and that one traveled Get almost place, 300 feet. Well, you saw Jack Jones, the pitcher, actually in a, in a tip of the cap moment and a little sportsmanship, just kind of walk down to the third baseline and give it up to him as that was one powerful swing. He tried to go with that breaking ball away. Drawn three walks, struck out only once. Oh, mercy! Way back in right field. Goodbye, home run on the top of the hill. And he has three walks so far in this Little League World Series, and we can see why people pitch around him. Because when they pitch to him, he can hit this a long way. About 285 feet. Goodness, he gets a hanging breaking ball. And like you said, 200, it, might, it might have gone 285 to 300, and I think it's went that distance high as well. I mean, this was high and far. Wow. And that's a great souvenir. That is only the second home run given up by Panama's pitches. In that hill and see in that ballpark. A high drive to right field. That one is in the parking lot. Emiliano Garza. Right off one of the cars. Whoever parked there was not thinking that they were in the line, in the game. He certainly would think you're safe, especially with a right-handed hitter up, but this is just launched to deep right field. And Mioli, who got, was able to retire him on a strikeout in his first at bat with a lot of pitches away. Well, and Sebastian went out there to investigate. Sebastian, what do you got? 
Guys, I know Dix is one of our sponsors here. You know if they do any body work? <laughs> I got the ball here. Okay. And here's a Chrysler 300, and it took it on the fly right here off the hood of the car. There uh -oh. is a little bit of a dent. Sorry to the folks with Texas Plate. You made the trip all the way up here to get your car banged up. Balls have hurt them so far. This ball is hammered. Back-to-back -back home runs. 6 nothing, California. Ready early. Had a baby touch home. What an offensive show for California here with back-to-back -back homers. Woo. This ball was hit well. Quentin Gago. Wow, that ball up in the zone. We've seen a lot of these hitters do an excellent job bringing their hands in so nicely. Get that barrel to the ball. Friday, or rather Thursday, and was dominant on the mound. This one driven deep. Oh, into the trees. Absolute moonshot by Hunter Ditsworth. Setting on a high fastball. And folks, he hit one out of here that went 325 feet, 100 foot over the fence on Thursday. Folks, he just hit this on 150 feet over the fence. This is light tower power. I mean, that might have killed the ballpark. bird. That went out of the ballpark. Continue to grind up at. Lancaster, a no doubter to left field. Where did that one land? My goodness, a two run home run for Hawaii. That one launched into left field. That baby is way out of here. A two run bomb for Aiden Jeffress. Makes it 4 2 Wyoming. Elastic pig. You know. Yes. Of course. Wow. That one. Watch that fly. Elastic ain't coming back. Gone and long gone. Into the night. A three run homer. Seven to one South Korea. Elastic Pig put a charge into this one. Yeah, when that hand goes up before the bat's even out of your hand, you know that you got it. That's a good feeling right there. Flies deep into the night here in Williamsport. All right, it's still the breakfast hour. This is Grant Hayes. Oh, he's done it again. Check out my man. He hits this so far. Look at him. Look, look, look at him. Look at him. He just bears it down. <laughs> uh, you talk boy. about eating fastballs. My man is eating today. Driven and gone. Way gone. And I say leads you two to nothing on Brock Myers. Fourth home run. Four for four. Every game he's gone deep. This is the way you get things started. He works the count back to full three, two. He's got such a nice swing through the zone, gets on top of that fastball. And he knew it right when it left the bat, and so did everybody else in the house. Incredible. Four games, four home runs. So the 2-1 to Pineda. That is hit high and deep and out. And there it is. The moment Panama has been waiting for. The three-run blast. And Panama jumps out to the 3-2 lead.
this swing. Tried to go with a break of ball, and that one just stayed right in the middle, and you think he knew he got it? He knew it right away. Reaction right when it comes off the bat. As meet Pineda knew he got it, and that's why. Wow, one over fence. the back fence. That's two fences. Yeah, I don't blame you. I the same reaction. That ball had to go close to 300 feet, past the flagpole, past the second fence. And Panama gets their first lead of the day. And it comes from an 11-year-old.